Hi, Andrew Kolokoff here. Welcome to today's do on our online community. Um, let me share, this is the opening one, a story with you. So there was this spiritual prodigy. His name was the Paramahansa Yogananda. I've told the story many times. People that know me have heard me tell this story. And he was the gentleman who brought yoga to the Western world. And um, he had a premonition and his guru had a separate premonition, but the same one, a vision, and they independently arrived at it. And uh, they both shared it with each other and he knew he had to come. And this was in the 1920s. Look at what yoga is today. But yoga, what most people don't know, if it was from here to here on a line, this much is the physical practice, but the rest is the spiritual practice. So he was immediately, the Paramahansa Yogananda, filling up concert halls, talking about how to find the God spark within ourselves um, instead of looking outside. And whatever you believe, that's fine. I'm not here to profess what is right or wrong. I'm here to share a message, and here comes the message. So he was giving a talk one day, and at the end of the talk, a gentleman walks up to him and said, Listen, I've traveled the world to listen to many gurus and spiritual prodigies. Uh, while your talk was excellent, what are you going to tell me that's different than anybody else who I have come to see? You see, I drink too much. I smoke too much. I'm a womanizer. Clearly, you're going to tell me to stop drinking. And the Yogananda paused and looked at him and said, no, no, continue to drink. He goes, well, then you're going to tell me to stop smoking. And the Yogananda did the same. He said, no, continue to smoke. He said, so what are you going to tell me to do? And he said, listen, I'm going to give you something very small to do, to practice. And if you practice it to the point it becomes a habit, then I'll give you another thing, and then another, and another. And oh, by the way, those things that you just mentioned, they'll just fall off of you. So really, the lesson, I think, in doing, a great way to begin this channel is we have so many things we want to correct in our lives, so many things we don't like about what we do, or we don't think about it, but we know we don't like it. Um, and we know what's wrong with, you know, we certainly know all the things that we can improve. I think so much about life is just adding new positive things on to our lives and a lot of those other bad things will fall off of us so with that as a backdrop i will be sharing with you a lot of those things over the course of these weeks and months of better little things that we can practice because when we do that and by the way giving is one of them hence why we're in this online community how to better help somebody every day um, you know I have two KPIs every day. I have a coffee or a lunch a day, and I make two to five introductions a day. I find out what is needed, what, they, what their challenges, challenges are, and I try to connect them with somebody that can help. And I've done that every day for 28 years. So I thank you for listening, and always remember, it's good business to make a difference in the lives we do business with and seek business from. It is. Try to do that. I promise you, you'll be more successful and you'll be happier along the way too.